Hey, I'm coming to you from Prodigy School of the Arts with your lesson recap for Stargazer by Melody Bober. This song is in the key of E flat major, which means all of our B's, E's, and A's will be flat throughout the song. Okay, we're starting on this E flat with finger number five, and the second note is B flat and the third note will be A flat. It's a big stretch, but you'll accomplish that by pivoting on your third finger. Step down. Right. So you have to slide and step down, slide and step down, slide and step down. Now we're gonna go back and start again with the first two notes. And when, instead of going to the A flat, we're going to go to G and back to B flat. So second part, measure two. Okay, and you can practice that over and over again. Then put it together, measure one and two. Right there, you notice I lift it up. There, at that point, there's a phrase. So we have to lift up right there and start again. And then instead of doing exact repeat, we're going to now go to B and E together. Okay. From there, we're going to go to A flat. So I'm gonna pick up our pinky and move over to A flat. Okay, and we're gonna go, we're going to play a fifth from A flat to D flat. There are two of them. I am currently in measure number five with the left hand. In measure six, our thumb is going to go up to the F. Pinky stays the same. Bring my thumb back to the E flat, and now my pinky goes down one. This is measure number seven. Back to my original position, E flat. I'm sorry, um, A flat, E flat, and play the, that as measure eight. And that is the left hand measure one through eight. The right hand is going to start on G, stepping up. Okay. Now you might have noticed that this C is accompanied by um, another note below it. I'm going to ignore the notes below and just read the top notes for a second. I'm going to move over to the C and start again. Okay, and then right here where my fourth finger is, I'm going to move over again. Okay, so that's the first four notes of each of these um, patterned groups that are coming up here in the right hand. Let's start to add the, our lower notes. Together with the C is going to be our second finger, which is on A flat. I'm going to hit that together. So let's try that. Okay. Do that a few times to get used to it. Now, right where our fourth finger is, which is the C, we're going to move over, put our thumb there, and do the same pattern. Now you might have noticed, right now we're in measure number six, you may have noticed that there's three notes there. Very simple, we're adding the B flat with our thumb. Thumb's just hanging out there, we'll have it do something. <laughs> okay? So it's kind of building, because first it just had an interval. And then now it has a chord. 
again. Okay, and if you recall that we had that, and we have to, this is where the chord hits with the B flat. Okay, and that's, it's, instead of a chord there, it's going to be an interval. So you'll notice there's two E flats there. And by the way, I'm at measure seven. Reach up to the A, to the, to the D. So we're here. So this ring finger is going to do two double duty here. We're going to be on the B flat and then we're going to be on C. B flat and then C. Okay, so once you play this note, you're going to let go. We're here. Hold it and now let go. And we're going to play this again. And we're going to play the B flat again, but this time we're going to make uh, have our ring finger, finger number four on C for this beautiful chord right here. That's measure eight. The end of measure eight, you're going to see a, uh, a step up. So after we play this, hold. That's going to be the beginning of the next section. And that concludes both left hand and right hand measures one through eight of Stargazer by Melody Bogart. I would like to encourage you to practice this each day, practice it in sections so that as each section becomes easier for you, you can build on it by adding a new section until you then are able to play the entire two lines with ease.